This is a demonstration tutorial video of Planning Center and ProPresenter. The audience is our worship leaders and in time um, the assumption is that it will be extended to members of the worship team as well as service leaders. So I'm going to log in to the system. Um, your welcome email should provide you with your initial password. Um, this is the dashboard. So, um, you can see it's set up for our missions focus uh, month. Um, there's today's service. Um, there's next Friday, Saturday, Sunday. And the following Sunday, the 18th. Um, I've put in as much info as available so far. Um, what you'll see at the top is you have plans, I've been looking at them all, songs, media and people, um, these are our databases, our source lists of information, um, but for all intents and purposes uh, the focus is for um, the service, so let's say Friday is the service or the, the plan that we want to have a look at, every service has the same structure worship, communion offering announcements, sermon, and final song. <clears throat> what the worship leader will be interested in is songs, which is on the left here, as in songs to populate this plan with um, people from the creative arts side, um, Penin in particular, who want to use the media um, section to add media um, video clips to um, the later parts of the service. Um, it's a drag and drop system as you can see when I move the mouse over a song it gives you some additional information so that you can see um, the difference and you can see keys as well. So as a worship leader um, you will be dragging and dropping songs into the right spots. Um, there's a lot of information here um, for now we're not making use of it, so simply click on accept, that will add it to service order, and away you go. Um, so you can also think, I've got enough, that's in the key of E, um, let's find another key song that's maybe E or A, um, God is able, A, now let's add that in, accept. Um, that's pretty much it um, in terms of the planning center side of things. Um, so let's log out for now and jump across. Sunday comes, we're at church, the people at the sound desk, they will be in ProPresenter. Um, this is my local copy. Um, so what the guys will do is they will come to the playlist section in this bottom left. Um, they will go new PCO or planning center online playlist and this is tapping into directly our services so for Friday um, that's it there um, the presentation isn't the greatest um, ideally we'd have the date on the left but I can't do much about that click on the plus and it's thinking it's adding it in it's looking for matches and so forth and there you have it, it's imported everything. Um, so you can see on the main area, I'm using the contiguous view so everything is listed. Um, it wants to match up. So um, you can see the songs. Now if it was linked to an actual song on our library here, um, it would come up. So very quickly, there's enough it didn't match because it's sensitive what we want to do is link it so we click link and it says drop it there so we just drag and drop and there you have it um, and that's how we link the two systems together so um, the order is naturally going to be important um, if videos are missing from here we will need to add them in from um, the video image bin um, through the 
usual uh, finder method here um, but that's more for the technical guys I will create a second video um, specifically for per presenter um, usage so uh, that's it for now if you've got any questions uh, let me know thanks for watching bye